Jake's zombie gaming. Wow. This is incredibly powerful. Like, their relationship is like... Hashtag relationship goals. <laughs> With grammar reforged, you will have Odin's blessing to walk a goddess into the halls of Helheim and challenge Hela as an equal. So Dillian was helping me. And a sword will lead me to him. This like is when amazing. we first met. Um it, it's it's the way they're telling the story is awesome. But there's always that little nugget in the back of my mind that, like, this is just, like, a, a a lady who did a bunch of drugs in a Denny's parking lot stabbing people with a mannequin arm. Like, eh, eh, I need to find Dillion! <laughs> okay, let's get this sword, though. Dillion gave her the strength to pass get the sword, get the sword. And she saw a way out. To leave her past behind and become a warrior in Dillian's clan. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. You left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. Oh shit! But years later. With Zinbel's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. A plague. Tony? Everyone suffered. Ooh. My father was not supposed to die like this. Oh no. Tony? Do you see it clearly now, Senua? The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. <gasps> you brought this plague to us. <laughs> you have blood on your I wonder if he actually said that or if that's just the voices in her head manipulating it. They're coming for you now. They're coming. They're coming to get you. Hold your heavy strike. Hold it. Hold your heavy strike. Hold it. 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 Hold Oh, I forgot. When they say focus, I actually need to press the focus. Finish this! Finish this! Finish him! All right, all right. Oh wow! Look at that! That's the corpse terrifying. The through itself over the ones I loved. The ship broke up under them. The ship that had sailed from the land of shining fields. Their memorial stone is sacred. Come not here in the sun. Come not with a sword. Come not crying over a naked corpse. Come not with disturbed mind. This is a terrifying. I don't know if this even has a Switch version. <laughs> wow, look at that. Look at that. Rivers of blood, burnt Do you horses. hear the suffering, Senua? Does your precious gift of sight let you see the souls that rot here in this sea of corpses? Do you feel the blood running cold on your skin? Do you hear their endless cries? Do you smell their putrid wounds? They were once brothers, Let's go. sisters, and loved ones. And look at what you have done to them. All because you were a coward, because you banned from your curse instead of facing it. When you turned your back on your father, Zimbo, you turned your back on the gods and let the darkness wreak havoc on your people. Why? I wonder if that's more of a representation of what her father 
would think, or what she thinks her father would say. Also, can we get some more brains in the chat for more bits? You are awesome. Thank you so much for all that. Oh, hey, we were fighting this guy before. I'll get some brains in the chat myself here shortly. Let's go. I've barely been hit, so I've gotten better with the uh, fighting system. Look at that sword. That sword looks amazing. the focus like makes them slow down who is it okay i got a second boom, 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 boom. thank you so much for the donations that's awesome i really appreciate it do you hear the voice of your mother galena she calls for you senoa go to her answer her pitiful call oh that voice is awful I mean, it's cool because, Don't like, the, the base to it's interesting, but he's an asshole. I need you. Trying to torture her for sure. are pretty interesting looking. Alright, we got a big guy. out of here? Ah, uh, there is. It's two, three. Jesus. This is a lot of fighting all at once. I'm liking it, because it's it's actually going pretty well for me. I wonder if 
it's after a parry that they allow the, uh, the, like, glowing from the sword to be there. Let's go. Let's go. Kick! I put Captain Falcon to shame with my kicks. This is nearly the end. Why do you still fight on? Let's go! Let's go, you two axe little bitch! Oh, what? You think that's enough to stop me? You think you can stop me? Isn't that what you deserve after all you've done? Give the darkness what it wants, let it swallow your soul and destroy all that you are. Why are you fighting for someone who's already <laughs> dead? Because you can bring him back. Just look around. We're gonna bring him back. The mean things he was saying was my mind making tricks on me. If his soul could be rescued, do you think he would thank you for what you have done to him, to his friends, to his father? <laughs> this guy is such a dick. I, that's why I think it was him that was manipulating them. The, uh, the things Dillian was saying to her after his father died. Obviously, he'd be upset about his father dying, but I don't think he would have lashed out at her like that after how supportive he is. Slash organ slash oh it's his arm okay so not an organ oh wow look at this there's my madre's face hello mama I can't fight it anymore not on my own. I think the plague oh, killed her father. Killed his father. Uh, oh, unless she attacked him during like an episode. That night, she gave up on her world to follow in the footsteps of her mother. To go to a place where the darkness couldn't reach her. Her eyes. Uh, maybe they're like a very thin blue. Look at me. Do you hear them? They're calling for me. We've lost so many. And I've lost my father. I can't lose you. You said it. I have blood on my hands. I didn't say that. You've done nothing wrong. See? I didn't think he said that. Zimbal was right. Everyone will suffer. Zimbal is a fake. He is a hateful, bitter liar. He's poison. And his words still haunt you. Who do you trust? Him? Or me? Do you still believe in me, Senua? In us? Wonder if he dies of the plague too. Maybe it wasn't like a raid on the village. Come back to me. Please. <sighs> Don't let this darkness come between us. <sighs> Maybe. Maybe she had, like, an episode that made her think, like, she was being attacked by her father or something, and he was trying to help her, and then she attacks and kills him. Battles are fought in the mind. That would make a lot of sense. He gave her the sword with which to fight in more ways than one. And she gave him her word. 
never to surrender. All she needed was a little help. A little hope. And the thing is, I don't know if maybe, like, we reach Helheim and then we are actually done with the game or something, but she's been skirting around the exact same areas this entire game. Like, there wasn't actually a huge, like, gap from where she was. Like, we started over there, came in through the mountains, we had a little area on the opposite side of where we're seeing this, because we were seeing this from the opposite side. But, like, the area isn't exactly super huge that we've been moving around. I think a lot of it is just what's in her head. What she's seeing is making everything seem bigger and longer and scarier and all of that. Well, obviously scarier, but, like, I don't think she's actually gone on some huge journey here. I think what we're at is just, like, maybe a small town size. Okay, so the voices are back. Sweet. Yeah, she's just in a room battling. Into the mountain. Can you see it? Shall we tell her where to go? It's not far. Is that Melheim? Just oh, up that. there. Listen to us. Sit. Shall we tell her where to go? We crawl under here. Does she know no. which way to look? Does she know her way into the mountain? She's a oh, oh we're coming back to the uh, base of the bridge, so maybe I was wrong about our positioning. Did you miss us? Oh, she did. She into the mountain. What if I went down, though? Oh, I could have just walked up this way, I guess. Okay. Well, we'll get back up on the bridge. We'll f see if we can fight Hella this time. There's a door. You can do it. You can see it. Come on, Senna. Go away. I'm not listening. I really do hope this is something where, like, she's actually having to, like, mentally go through all this, but, like, in the end, she actually overcomes her mental illness. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I hope that, like, there's a happy ending for her because her whole life has been torture. I will tell you of a great hero named Sigurd, son of Sigmund, no less. Born after his father's death, Sigurd is cared for by the dwarf, Rain, But Rain does not love the boy. Instead, he plans to use him for his own ends. Why are these guys you such dickbags? You see, father possessed a great treasure given to him by the gods. But Rain's brother, Fafner, killed his father and took the gold all for himself. Fafner hid the treasure out on a heath and could not leave it. And from the evil in his heart... He turned into a dark creature. A dragon. Oh. Wait, I thought Fafnir was a wolf, not a dragon. Oh. Well, can't go that way. We'll go against the other bridge. Or go over the other bridge, not against it. I guess we won't. Okay, we jumped down. Go quick! Go quick! Okay. I had a feeling that bridge was gonna come down. <laughs> okay. That breathing is uncomfortable. What is it? She can feel it. No. 
You are here, Senua. It can smell your stink. What are you afraid of, Senua? How would you say Dillion if you are too much of a coward to step into the shadow? They can't stop me. Then do it. Jake's Army Gaming.